Yeah, so the boys have just stopped for morning tea, and um, the first run they did 2,650. I've just gone down to check the tally counters. Uh, that's pretty impressive. They're looking at cracking 10,000 for the day. That'll be the first time that I'm aware that a team's cracked 10,000. Um, so they've got seven stands going. Uh, Richard said he would normally have three sheepos he'd bring along for that then, for the seven stands, but he's got a few of his kids here to, today as well. The school holidays, and he's trying to get them out of the house. So that's why there's a few extras hanging around. Um, and the, the cockers keep them up too. So it's uh, it's pretty impressive to watch. Eh? There's just sheep for miles. Um, it's just about too fast in some ways. Um, but it's not causing any problems. And cocky seems happy, and, and, and everyone's pretty happy, and the boys are working hard. Um, yeah, they're going well. Yeah, so Richard, just tell us a bit about the day. Yeah, well, today we're just here at Craig James, just dagging a few lambs up for sharing. So we we'll, uh we're not too sure how many he's got lined up, he just said he'll fill the day in for us, but for the morning we've done just over 2,600, or just over 2,600 for the morning, so two hours work, so that's our plan today. What's your, what's your best tellies for the day? What's uh, some of the big tellies you've got? Before this was 8,500 crutching, and that was drenching lambs as well at the same time, but that's a record tally for us, yep. so we hope to beat that today. And do you do many ewes and lambs, or just ewes, or just lambs? Or? Uh, we do everything, we cater for everything. We can Dag ewes, dag lambs, half belly ewes, full belly lambs, full belly ewes, whatever we can do, everything except shed them. <laughs> At this stage? At this um, stage, yeah. How long, you, how long have you been working on these Crutch Masters? Uh, I'll be on them 10 years, 10 years, well, since they first come out pretty much, so yeah, 10 years I've been on them and I really enjoy it. On my own for four years now, so this is my fourth season kicking in. Yeah, and how's how's the business going? What are they? How are they? How are they working with your business? Yeah, really good, really good. Um, I really enjoy it. Like these here, like yeah, they're the easiest machines to work on. But for digging, you know, like it's so simple. And I've got a good crew of guys behind me with me, so that's working well. Yeah, and how many trailers you got going? Uh, at this stage, I've just got two running, but I can run up to three at any one stage, and they're all like three stand trailers. I've got one that's I've just converted to a four stand. And it's made a hell of a difference. It's going real good. So. Yeah. And what do the farmers think of it? Oh, they love it. They love it. Like they can get sheep in and out and back on the feed, you know, straight away. So they're coming in full. We don't matter if they're full, empty, or wherever you want them. But if they want them full, they can run them straight on the trailer and back straight back out on the feed again. So there's no worries, you know. They love it. Especially Should have let that one run through, mate. That's what I would have done. I bet you Richard's not getting many daggy ones.